19 Day Fast, Wikipedia Article Audio The 19 Day Fast is a 19 day period of the year, during which members of the Baha'i faith adhere to a sunrise to sunset fast. Along with obligatory prayer, it is one of the greatest obligations of a Baha'i, and its chief purpose is spiritual, to reinvigorate the soul and bring the person closer to God. The fast was instituted by the Bab, and accepted by Baha'u'llah, the founder of the Baha'i faith, who stated its rules in his Book of Laws, the kitab i -Aqdas. The 19 days of fasting occur immediately before the beginning of the Baha'i New Year, on the vernal equinox. History Definition Spiritual Nature Laws Concerning Fasting Exemptions from Fasting Notes The Bab, the founder of the Babi faith, instituted the Badi calendar with 19 months of 19 days in his book The Persian Bayan, and stated that the last month would be a period of fasting. The Bab stated that the true significance of the fast was abstaining from all except the love of the messengers from God. The Bab also stated that the continuation of the fast was contingent of the approval of a messianic figure, him whom God shall make manifest. Baha'u'llah, the founder of the Baha'i faith, who claimed to be the one foretold by the Bab, accepted the fast but altered many of its details and regulations. The Baha'i fast resembles fasting practices of several other religions. Lent is a period of fasting for Christians, Yom Kippur, and many other holidays for Jews, and the fast of Ramadan is practiced by Muslims. The Baha'i fasting most resembles the fast of Ramadan except that the period of fasting is defined as a fixed Baha'i month, whereas Muslims fast during a lunar month, whose specific Gregorian dates vary from year to year. Baha'u'llah established the guidelines of the fast in the kitab i Aqdas, his Book of Laws. Fasting is observed from sunrise to sunset during the Baha'i month of Allah and it is the complete abstention from food, drink, and smoking. Observing the fast is an individual obligation, and is binding on all Baha'is who have reached the age 15 until the age of 70, it is not enforceable by the Baha'i administrative institutions. Various exemptions are given to the sick, the traveling, and others. While Baha'is are allowed to fast at other times during the year, fasting at other times is not encouraged and is rarely done. Baha'u'llah permitted the making of vows to fast, which was a Muslim practice, but he stated that he preferred that such vows be directed to such objectives as will profit mankind. In the Northern Hemisphere the fast occurs at a time before the equinox that is coming out of the winter months where the days are shorter than the night and approach parity. In the Southern Hemisphere the fast occurs at a time also before the equinox and come out of the summer months where the days are longer than the nights and approach parity of length. Along with obligatory prayer it is one of the greatest obligations of a Baha'i and is intended to bring the person closer to God. Shaggy Effendi, the head of the Baha'i faith in the first half of the 20th century, explains that the fast is essentially a period of meditation and prayer, of spiritual recuperation, during which the believer must strive to make the necessary readjustments in his inner life and to refresh and reinvigorate the spiritual forces latent in his soul. Its significance and purpose are, therefore, fundamentally spiritual in character. Fasting is symbolic, and a reminder of abstinence from selfish and carnal desires. There are laws and practices associated with the 19-day fast that were established by Baha'u'llah in the Kitab-i-Aqdas, his Book of Laws. 
There are various exemptions provided in the Kitab i Akdas to the obligation of fasting. One meeting the exemptions may, however, still choose to fast if they so wish. Those not fasting are asked to be discreet, and eat frugally and in private. Exemptions are also given to those traveling during the fast. Exemptions are given when the travel is longer than nine hours. If the traveler breaks their journey for more than 19 days, they are only exempt from fasting for the first three days. Also if they return home, they must begin fasting right away. The period of fasting begins with the termination of the intercalary days and ends with the festival of Noruz, abstinence from food, drink, and smoking from sunrise to sunset. Fasting is obligatory for men and women once they attain the age of 15. If one eats unconsciously during the fasting hours, this is not breaking the fast as it is an accident. In regions of extremely high latitude where the duration of days and nights vary considerably, the times of the fast are fixed by the clock. Those who are ill, those who are younger than 15 or older than 70, those who are engaged in heavy labor, women who are pregnant, women who are nursing, women who are menstruating.